Are there any particular recording sessions that you remember here at Chess? I remember most of them. <laughs> yeah, especially on the uh, Muddy Waters Electric Mud session. Down. Yeah, you know, with uh, all the guys, you know, Pete Cozy and uh, Roland Faulkner and Charles Stepney and myself. And, uh, and were you playing on many of those sessions? Were you producing? What was your role here at Chess? Well, I, I had a, a varied role. Sometimes I was just a saxophonist. Sometimes I was involved because I helped write the song, like, for instance, uh, a little, a, a little Milton's We Gonna Make It. I was one of the songwriters, and I also played the solo on the record, that record. I played the solos on all of Dell's records that, uh, you know, and I remember the Dell's, the Dell sessions, they were really hilarious because all of the Dell's were characters. They were really funny guys, really nice guys from Harvey. And uh, they had a producer named Bobby Miller and the arranger was Charles Stepney. And uh, so I was invited in to do most of the sax solo work on all of those. I remember those. And um, I, re I remember a lot of the Ramsey Lewis sessions. I, I, wasn't, I wasn't playing on them, but I, re I was around for that. And one of the outstanding things that happened was uh, a lot of the musicians went on to do other things, for instance, when I walked in the studio upstairs here in this building, they put me in charge of the rhythm section. And uh, sitting on drums was Maurice White, the guy who formed Air When the Fire later. And Maurice White was our drummer. He later, he, he, he took the job with Ramsey Lewis when Ramsey Lewis trio broke up because they had an in crowd. And uh, the trio disintegrated and then so Ramsey hired a whole new trio, Cleve Eden, uh, Maurice White on drums. And uh, that trio uh, was in business for about four years, three or four years, and then Maurice White left and went to the West Coast and formed Air One and Fire. Mm -hmm.